What's going on guys? My name is Millennial Rebel and welcome back to my Rebelcraft modded survival let's play. I did some work off camera. I got a bunch of stuff to actually build a house today. I made some tools. I'm going to show you guys what I did off camera. So yeah, let's jump right into it. First thing I want to show you is I collected a bunch of wood. I got lots of oak wood, lots of birch. Got almost four stacks of oak wood now. We got lots of birch and dark oak for building our new house. I actually found a place to build our new house and got this guy right here which is a stone lumber axe. It's from the Tinkers mod, and it allows you to cut down whole trees. So it's basically like the tree cavitator, but instead of tree cavitator, which is really, really slow, I actually got Tinkers Contract and Fast Leaf Decay, so trees disappear awfully quickly, and I am actually going to show you that right now. If I go over to one of these trees over here, we'll take down this rubber wood tree. But see, with this, even just with the stone, with the slow mining speed, which I did upgrade it a little bit, I think it starts off with like 1.2 mining speed, and this one has, I think four or five because if you this little red patch on it means you add redstone and that actually ups your mining speed and then i put durability on it. i took one of my diamonds and put it on the tip that's why it's got the blue tip on it and it adds 500 durability by putting that diamond on there so you can actually take down a whole tree this fast yeah that's pretty insane and like i said with the fast leaf decay it works really well together because then you can take down all the logs and the tree disappears really fast and you get all the saplings which, from all the mining and stuff, or all the wood collecting and stuff, I've got like three stacks of oak sap saplings. Okay, almost two stacks of oak saplings. I was exaggerating. But yeah, I'm gonna. I actually found a place, like I said, to build our new house that is right over there somewhere. That's a very large plains biome, so I figured that would be good. So I'm gonna go over there and I'm gonna try and get some work done on our new home, and I will be back with you in a little bit. Alright, guys, I think I got a decent base going for our house. I. When I build, I like to do lots of big windows, but this is basically the whole out, outer shell of our base is just about ready. Um, I'm actually going to make some carpenter's blocks and put stairs in here and give them this texture because this is a chiseled texture, so you can't actually make the chiseled stairs like this, but if you do the carpenter's blocks, you can make them into stairs, so that's what I'm going to do for the windows. And I'm probably going to do like a dark oak roof with a cobblestone border, but... I'm going to do a little bit more work on this. Hopefully next time you see it, it will be done. Alright guys, and there we have it. I haven't finished the floor yet. I'm actually kind of sick of building for right now. But this is basically the whole house. We'll do a little run around the outside here. It's just a little T-shaped house. Nothing too fancy, but it did take me probably about an hour to build. And I didn't do, the, like I said, I didn't do the floor yet. I'm actually going to get... Some more Tinker's Tools, I'm going to get an excavator for clearing out all that dirt before I attempt to fill in the floor. But yeah, that's basically the whole house, and we got this carpenter's door here. I, I really love the carpenter's doors because you can make them anything you want. I just have dark oak wood for now. Like I said, no floor. Um, I'm going to get some tools off camera and move in probably later, but for the rest of this episode, we're actually going to take on that right there and see how many times we can die. I believe that's another one of the rogue dungeons, and I don't have a clue what's in there. All I know is that there's some kind of OP mobs in there, so we're probably going to die a lot. But we are going to see what we can do. So I got my apples here. I do have a couple chests. I have some stuff like this in my building materials. I'm actually going to put this stuff in there for now because we shouldn't need this stuff. And we're going to take our bucket of water. And actually, I should probably make some more torches, but all my coal's at home. Oh, well. So let's go. We're going to go see if we can get some cool stuff out of this rogue dungeon over here. Alright, and we're here, and from the looks of it, there is a ton of skeletons just outside this door. But if you look up at the map there, you can see just how big this thing is. That almost looks like a cake dungeon, but I don't have a clue. So I guess we'll just go check it out and see how many times we can die. See if we can get some cool stuff. I'm gonna break this spawner, break this spawner. No, skellies, no, 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 not, not skeletons, skeletons, no, not skeletons. I'm gonna die. We're gonna have a death counter, because I'm gonna die right about now. Great. That's one death. And I'm back. So, can we die some more? Are these guys going to wreck my life if I come back in here? Why can't I hit you? Well, I got one of them. What, are you like... Are you... Like, I can't even hit him. Oh, now he's running. No, no, no potion. Whew. We did it. Room one, cleared. I'm going to eat this apple real quick. Nom, 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 Can we not die in here? We're going to die so many times in this, guys. I don't even know if there's anything good in here to find. 
There's another skeleton there that's probably going to try and wreck my face. We'll wreck his face before he can wreck mine. Haha, <laughs> gotcha, Skelly, gotcha. Didn't even see it coming. I snuck right up on him. A beautiful painting. It is Jesus riding a pig. Okay. I do see a chest in this room here. Anything good in here? And it's empty. Great. Did we come in here for nothing? I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be loot in here, but... No skelly, no skelly, no skelly, no skelly, no skellies. No, no, what are we doing here? No! Stop shooting me! Stop it. Stop it. Stop. I was not ready for this, guys. Certainly was not ready to come in here. But, oh well. Provides a lot of action. Hopefully you guys like watching me die, because that's pretty much all this video is going to be for the rest of it anyways. So I just fell, but before I fell, I saw a chest, and I'm going to see if there's anything in there, because that's a really weird spot for a chest. Ooh, a block of gold. Yeah, we will take that. But I just heard a door open, so I'm kind of scared. And I fell again. Can we stop taking the fall damage? I'm taking enough damage from skeleton bows. Eat the apple! Thank you. Died once so far, so that's pretty good. I apologize for the lag, guys. It's getting kind of crazy. There's a ton more bookshelves if we needed those, but we already got enough of those for our enchantment table, which I will actually probably set up. Because the way I have my house set up, I want to do some stuff in the basement, like some of my technical machine stuff like that, so... We will tread on in here. This is like a whole library in here. That's kind of cool. Hopefully there's nothing in here that's going to wreck my face. I don't think iron armor is enough to take this on and not die at least 70 times. No, 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 no. Where am I getting shot from? Aha. Gotcha. Where are them arrows coming from? Do you guys hear that? Because I do, but I don't have a clue where I'm getting shot from. Anything in here? Uh, just some coal. I guess we'll take it. <clears throat> this is not being as productive as I was hoping it was going to be. Lots of death and not a lot of cool stuff. The best thing we got so far is a block of gold. I mean, come on. One block of gold. Is that dude downstairs shooting at me? Where is he at? I. This is ridiculous. I know I'm getting shot at, but where am I getting shot at from? This thing is, this place is really confusing. I'm having very difficult time making my way through this place. Did we go in these rooms? There's a beds. I don't think really, I don't really think skeletons need to sleep, but, you know. Just beds, beds, and more beds. Now, is this the way we came in? Oh, these guys are fighting each other over here? Geronimo! Die! 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 Did he drop a... No. I'm like, wait, did he drop a diamond sword? But that was actually another skeleton holding it. No, 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 no. Do not drink your potions. No. No. Whew! We lived through another battle. What? I still hear the shooting, but I don't have a clue where it's coming from. I really want to find it, because it's annoying. Stop shooting random things. I know there's another skelly down here, so I guess we'll go down. Not that I want to face another skeleton, but... Eh, 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 got him. This sword is a boss. It does like 15 attack damage. Nothing like the ultimate sword, though. That's what I really want, the ultimate sword. And then, nothing can kill me. Well, I guess the ultimate sword don't do no good if you ain't got no armor to go with it. No skelly, no skelly, no skelly. Die, 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 die. I'm gonna die again. And there's a zombie coming up the stairs. Whoa. Whoa. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die! Wow. Get your life together. Learn how to control your stuff. I feel like wherever them arrows are sticking into, it's causing me lag. Whoa. Whoa. Diamond armored skelly. You need to die right now, sir. No. Thank you. He dropped emeralds. There he is. And he's going to kill me. Yep, he killed me. And we're back. Die, die, die. 
Die! No, die! You're not gonna kill me again, thank you. What are, what are these guys dropping? I'm dropping emeralds? Sweet! And that solidified experience. I wish I could pick all these arrows up, that'd be awesome. Maybe I'd stop lagging so hard. I guess we're gonna go down again. Not that I really want to, but... Die, 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 die. Zombie horde! Zombie horde! Kill them all! Ooh, that red heart container is awesome. Because those you can actually up your health with if you combine them with a necrotic bone and a canister. You also need a jeweled apple, which is diamonds around an apple. They're really easy to make, but... No, not a baby zombie, not a baby zombie, not a baby zombie. They're really easy to make, but they add a full heart to your health permanently, which is really awesome. Ow, 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 We're gonna die again, guys. We are gonna die again. Probably from fall damage, because I just decided to be a noob and jump off of there. Put that money down. Think you're some kind of rich zombie? Think you're balling or something? Gonna be balling when I beat you down with my sword. Whoops, don't open your inventory, stupid. Why are we going up? We need to go down. We need to keep going down, down, and down. And I need to eat this apple. Die, Skelly, die, Skelly. Ha! You didn't even get a shot off. How's that make you feel? Oh god. And I'm on soul sand? Are you kidding me? Yep, this is where I die again. And I'm dead. Alright guys, I think I'm going to end this episode here. I definitely am not prepared to take on that dungeon. It is very insane. I think I died like four times. But we got a lot of progress done on the house. So all that's left, left to do is the floor and we will be ready to go. Like I said, I'm going to move in between episodes and fix the floor between episodes after I get some new tools. But if you liked, go ahead and leave a like. I'll let you and goodbye.